Hello everyone, welcome to NG Classes YouTube channel for a video lecture series in digital signal processing. In this video lecture we shall consider realize the system function h of z which is equal to 1 plus 3 by 2 z inverse plus 4 by 5 z to the power minus 2 plus 5 by 9 z to the power minus 3 plus 1 by 9 z to the power minus 4 using direct form. How can I do this? So this is I'm going to say one of the most and very easiest numericals in the entire digital signal processing course because if we know the concept of delay element and z transform and we can get this quite easily so what i do now is let me just draw a straight line yes here i'm going to write the input x of n plus uh, 1 is there that means I have to get x of n that gets multiplied with n I would get x of n after this I need 3 by 2 z to the power minus 1 how do I get z to the power minus 1 to get z to the power minus 1 I need to get a delay element is that fine so I have got a delay element here and after this I'm going to get what x of n minus 1 or z to the power minus 1 that gets multiplied with 3 by 2 so again I just have to draw a few more straight lines here just a minute yes let me draw another straight line and this would get multiplied with as I said 3 by 2 and I would also consider a signal here x of n x of n should also be added so hence I would consider x of n and I would proceed this here till this point right yes here I am going to sketch 1 and here I am going to multiply this with the 3 divided by 2 so what should I do I have to add these two hence I must have an adder at this point of place correct yes so now I'm done with the first one what should I do next next it is quite simple I need to get another delay element so let me get one more uh, delay element here and I just have to proceed further yes so let me join these two points and next what should I do I need 4 by 5 z to the power uh, minus 2 for that what I have to do again extend this straight line and here I'm going to get this point yes what is that I need to multiply this with 4 divided by 5 is that okay 4 divided by 5 z to the power minus 2 and what should I do I have to add that with the previous signal so here comes the previous signal so I must have an adder again at this point of time so let me have an adder here and that gets added with the previous signal this is the signal is that okay similarly moving further I need another delay element z to the power minus 3 so I already have two delay elements this is going to be the third delay elements and uh, just let me join these two points yes and what I want I want 5 by 9 z to the power uh, minus 3 how do I get that so again extend this line here I'm going to multiply this I'm going to get a signal and this I'm going to call it as 5 divided by 9 so here I would write 5 divided by 9 z to the power minus 3 what I have to do I have to add this with the previous signal what is the previous signal here comes the previous signal correct so now I should have an adder at this point correct and simply moving on further I need 1 by 9 z to the power minus 4 so how do I get that I have to get another adder uh, another uh, delay element first let me get the delay element here and that gets multiplied with what 1 divided by 9 so let me consider that yes so just me uh, let me just take this line till this point and extend this till here correct that needs to be added with the previous signal 
and I said this should be multiplied this should be scaled by 1 divided by 9 finally I should add that with the previous signal hence I would have an adder here and uh, what is the last thing last thing is to get the output y of n so here I am going to get the output y of n so let me write that so we started with x of n and after all the input and delay elements and multiplying factors I get the output y of n so this is the simple direct form realization of, for the given system function h of z I think there would be not there would not be any doubts here if st uh, still there are any doubts please let me know them on to the comment section and I'm happy to answer those uh, doubts thank you so much for watching